American citizens, man. Love that. Solar eclipse today, boys. How are we feeling about this fucking thing? I can't tell if I'm just too far down the Twitter for you page of conspiracy theories about all the weird shit that's happening on this day. We're firing like rockets and shit. We're turning on these particle accelerators trying to find hidden particles in the, in the universe and shit. I mean, I don't know. What do you think? What do you think's going on? Anything? Or is it all just a weird coincidence? Everybody's been, you think the Fire Nation's going to attack? Cloudy in Texas, can't see shit? Honestly, bro, that just means the solar eclipse isn't real. If there's anything that I've learned about fucking internet, is that if I can't see it, it's not real. Okay? Twitter's going to be wild and hilarious when uh, this shit does happen. Here's the problem, man. It's like, yo, at first I liked this For You page that Elon gave me. But now I'm not so sure. I've said this a couple times, but like the For You page, I actually think, I don't, Twitter used to be the platform you went to to get like real-time conversation in, in parallel with the things that are happening IRL. But I feel like since there's so many people that are on for you by default, I just Twitter, I don't use it the same way that I do it. I used to anymore. Like, I feel like I miss out on things that are happening in front of me in real time. And I, that would have never happened years and years ago before I was on Twitter. The amount of porn and brutal murders I see on Twitter lately is insane. Yeah, it's pretty fucking insane, honestly. All the CERNs coming on today, two in the U.S., one in the other country caused those earthquakes, then the path eclipse is going down. Yeah, man. I don't know, brother. That's a can of worms. I'm not really sure we want to open up. At least I don't want to open it up. Hit the Benjamin. Yo, big donkey, brother. We we just got here, man. Honestly, this weed, this weed streaming thing has been a blessing and a curse. No, they're just pointing at me, poking me with sticks. Smoke the weed. Smoke that weed, you old piece of shit. I'm like, yo, I got to live a little bit in sobriety. Are you hitting top 250 today? Gentlemen, I got to be honest with you. I don't think top 250 is going to happen this season. I've lost so many games already. Uh, I feel like in a weird way, I feel like, and, and I probably don't mean this at all. I just want to be clear. I don't think I mean this at all. Part of me wishes there was like a, a week downtime in between season two and season three because I fucking grinded my ass off to get to top 250 for season two. Season three literally starts the next day. And I'm just like a little uh, not demotivated. It's not that I'm not motivated. It's just like, fuck me. I I want us to I want the new maps, I want the new guns. Honestly, at this point too, I think I think people have asked for too much now with a with a weapon meta. I was thinking about this. We should have never asked them to nerf the MC I don't think anybody was asking for an MCW nerf or the rival nerf or whatever the fuck was happening, but the fact that they're nerfing them now, the game just feels different. It feels it feels strange mcw for me shooting marshmallows the rival without the uh original sprint to fire speed feels a little awkward as well i don't know bro i feel like at at this point i'd rather just have the two most overpowered guns in people's hands and that's it like instead of this weird every time i die shit i'm just complaining about the gun i don't know but, you know, the last two days, I don't think we can really count it. I feel like I've been in a weird mental headspace. So today I'm in a better mood. At least I'm hoping I am. And we're going to try to look at everything with a little bit more of a positive spin on it, which is not normally my expertise, but we're going to give it a shot. I'm going to change this song, gentlemen. I'm sorry. Yo, Pissy Pure, thank you so much for the 42 months, brother. Your piss is pure. And, brother, I would drink it if I had the opportunity. If I was stuck in the desert, had nothing else, I'd drink that piss. Yo, Brad, thanks for the prime, brother. Appreciate you, man. Yeah, we're trying to get good vibes today. We're trying to get good vibes today. 
What, chat? You're telling me if we were stuck in the middle of the fucking desert and we were about to die and I had a cup full of this guy's piss that we wouldn't drink it? There's no way that you guys aren't drinking that piss. Because then we take that piss, we turn it into our own piss, and now we drink forever. It's science. Bottoms up. Crap, crack open a cold can of piss. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about, brother. That's just good drinking right there. Liquid gold. <laughs> Metaphorically and physically, for sure. Yeah. New master with 100 bits. They need to add more ARs to ranked. I'm looking forward to seeing the ball in action. Yeah, I agree with that wholeheartedly. Definitely need to add more ARs into the mix. You know, it's like sitting. people are sitting here complaining about the fucking Uzi and ranked right now and saying that it needs to be GA'd. Well, that's because we have still five subs available and only one AR. Like, dude, just open up the fucking rank play ARs to the Holger and everything else that's available, just like they have with the subs. And then we have more guns to choose from. Nobody's complaining. I don't know. At this point, I actually don't even know if adding more guns is the right answer. It's already been GA'd. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. I'm going to use that shit. Although the Uzi, like, it's enjoyable, but I still think the, the rival is more fun to use. My Yap King is live. I'm here for you, Ajax. I'm here for you, baby. Simple. I struggle a lot with mental health. Your streams help a lot. You're hilarious, bro. Been a fan since 2014. More love from New Zealand. Yo, Lord. Hey, brother. Keep pushing, man. We all struggle with it. Just this last couple days, man. I had a couple bad days and, you know. So, yeah, listen. Listen. The good days are going to come. The bad days are going to come. You just got to ride it out. How do you feel about the BP50 as a competitor to the MCW? Can I just say that, yo, Chad, who's been watching my stream for the last couple weeks, man? I'm going to come. Everybody's going to come. I know you guys are my chatters because even when I use come in a real sentence, we're still talking about male fluids. All right, you guys have been watching my stream. Yo, listen, I've been talking about the BP-50. I'm not saying, like, I made the BP-50 a thing by any means. But, like, the day that the BP-50 released, I was like, dude, I want to use this and rank so bad. I've been talking about this fucking BP-50 since way back when. So I'm all, I'm here for it, man. I've been, I've been, I've been pushing for more guns in this rank playlist, dude. I want it. We need it. I'm looking for it, dude. Why won't they give me what I want? Come here or come in her. Yo, great Gregorius. That's a little too real, brother. That 10 gifted got you moving different today, huh? As soon as you put a her in that sentence. Like, if we're going to make jokes about come, I feel like the only way we're going to get away with it is we talk about our fellow man. Can't talk about that. Can you believe my wife won't let me dye my hair platinum? Kylos, I, at this point, brother, I think you need to, you need to force her hand. Just go to the, just go to the, just go to the hairstylist and just get it done. That way she won't have a choice. Maybe she'll surprise. Maybe she'll like it. Maybe she'll like it. Maybe she'll be surprised. What's up, brother? How you doing, Curry? Good to see you, man. Platinum hair. Nate shot was 10 out of 10, by the way. JKL, you're too kind to me. I'm waiting for my grays to come in full time, brother. I'm trying to, you know, I don't have the jawline clearly. Yo, you guys think that mewing shit actually works? You think if I bought, like, that rubber mold and chewed on it all day like a goddamn fucking psychopath that my jawline would be accentuated? Because I'm just... I'm, I'm growing my facial hair back. Um, Not before I grow all of my love back right now to give to this fucking guy. Ferret X plays. Jesus Christ, brother. Where did you come from with this 50 gifted? Is that nuke going off around me? Oh, no. Yo, brother, did you just start the day off, like, with just... That's some solar eclipse energy right there. How do I say your name? Is it Ferret? Is that, that's not how we spell Ferret IRL. Actually, I had a Ferret as a kid, I swear to God. And now I'm... It's F-E-R-R-E-T, right? Yeah. He was a stinky little bastard. Yo, X plays. Ferret X plays. Where you at in this chat right now? I need you to talk. Nobody else talk except for this guy that just dropped 50 gifted for me. I had a ferret horrible fucking thing. Ferrotex. Ferrotex. Yo, brother, you just knocked out that pronunciation for me. 
Yo, listen, fair text. When somebody comes in and drops a 50 like that, like I did everything. Hold on. Yo, fair text. I'm talking to you and only you, by the way, right now. Yeah, it, listen, I know I'm just a fucking streamer and it's annoying when I complain about shit and I don't, I'm just, I'm just naturally by nature a complainer. That's just how I am. The last two days on stream for me weren't great. I took a fucking day off to play golf, had five drinks. I think I had a two day hangover. It hasn't been fun. I did everything I could. Yesterday, I ate healthy all day. I went to bed at 9 o'clock promptly. I was asleep by 9.30. I was up at 5 a.m. I got up. I took a shower, wiped my ass, took like two shits, and I told myself like, yo, today we're going to make today a good day. No matter what happens on stream, no matter how many games I lose, no matter what is going on on stream, we're going to make today a good day. And brother, Feratex, let me say this. That 50 gifted could not have come in a more timely manner. I just feel like you set me up for greatness, and now I've got no time, no opportunity, no reason to complain. 50 gifted like that, Feratex? I'm going to shake that hand, brother. Thank you, Feratex. Seriously, bro. That 50 gifted just brought me life, man. Hit the moonwalk? I can't. But if Feratex wants me to shake this ass and shake that hand again, I will. Appreciate you, brother. Can we get... Yo, chat, I, I need you guys to get down on this with me. Can we get a W spam in the chat for my boy Feratex? Please. Yo, Feratex, on some real shit though, can we uh what are the chances I can just call you Ferret? I know I'm gonna call you Feratex. Yo, Eradicates, thank you so much for the prime, brother. Heinrichs, thank you so much for the 100 bits. Where the fuck did this guy Feratex just come from? I love it, baby. I love it, Feratex. Chad, I got bad news. Some of the, something's going on. Yo, McGowan, my third monitor won't turn on, and I can't find this damn remote for it. This thing is out of commission. No, Ferret. I'm not going to call you Ferret. I'm going to call you Ferret Tax, brother. Uh, yo, Ted Word, what up, baby? Thanks for the prime, brother. What's up, brother? Thanks for the prime, brother. Chad, I decided, uh, I decided that I'm going uh, to forgive LaRue today. I think yesterday, yo, yesterday I was actually kind of annoyed that this guy didn't come play with me, but I get it. Um, there's no place in my heart for hate. I was, I was a little too emotional yesterday. I let the emotions get the best of me. I was actually pissed at Larue, but we're we we're on, we're back we're back we're back being friends today. Okay, life is too short. To be fucking pissed off at this guy because he didn't play with me one day on Call of Duty. All right? Still waiting on neck and face tats? I don't think the face tats are going to happen, brother. I said, don't cry, Nate Shot. You sound like J. Cole last night? Nah, bro. I think the internet's tripping, man. Five gifted anytime you kill LaRue? All right, mustache. I'll remember that. Yo, so you guys are seeing all this J. Cole. I woke up to it on my timeline while I was on the pot scrolling. Here's, here's what I think happened with J. Cole, man. Yo, Oakley, thanks for the tier one. Africano, thank you very much for the tier one. The reason why I think J. Cole apologized, it's kind of like, I'm not comparing. I, I, can't, I can't tell you exactly how he feels, but I'm taking a guess. For me, whenever... So, back in the day, in the early, the early uh, years of Twitter and Call of Duty and everything... Talking shit was fun, you know? It was great to just, like, yap at each other, try to think of some funny, like, witty shit, and make them feel dumb if you were pissed off at somebody. But let me say this. Now that I'm older, and now that I've got, like, a, a life that I love to live, I got a family that loves me, I've got a lot of good things going on in my life, I don't ever, I, like, I don't want to unsettle the peace you know what i mean i don't want to disrupt the peace of mind that i have knowing that i'm kind of just navigating in my own little vacuum here my life is pretty good i'm in my own bubble there's not really anything that can disrupt that i think i think i think j cole was like oh this guy dissed me all right let me spit some shit let me do it he releases the track and then he sits there 24 hours and he's like, why the fuck did I do that, dude? I don't actually care. I, I respect this guy. I don't, even, I don't even want to bring this type of disruption to the peace of mind that I have every day. I think, I, think, I think he did that because 
that's not really how he felt and was just kind of like felt like he needed to respond everybody egging him on like oh i can't let this guy disrespect me whatever puts out the track and realizes like he just bringing more hatred into his life and he doesn't want it i had to, and i kind of respect it man like every time i talk shit to somebody on twitter like it feels good for a minute and then i realize like i didn't even care enough to do that i don't even want to do that he said his homies pushed him to respond yeah i figured that's it you know I don't know. As you get older, man, the, le- the, 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 the more distractions, the worse things are. And I think he kind of just leaned into that distraction and it, he, did, he regretted it almost immediately. That's how I see it anyways. And I kind of respect it. I, I don't really understand. It's like all the bloggers and everybody like academics on his ass, everybody talking shit, making fun of him for apologizing. You know, they're just here for the the fucking dope that they get from watching it all unfold on the internet. But at the end of the day, like this guy, J Cole probably just doesn't want to, you know, bring that type of fucking stress into his life if he don't need to. So I kind of respect it personally. You want to call me soft. You can say whatever the fuck you want. You want to call,